I played a whole lot of Spider-Man. Yeah, you did. Uh, yeah, I did too. That's more. I also did. Or less what the time was spent doing. Ah, uh, yeah, man. That is a very good. Not doing anything like new, new at all. thing. It not just in video games in general. Yeah, not. It's just a really good, uh, you know. Time, it's always fun to swing everywhere, of course. Of course, the swinging is the best thing ever. Of course, I'm in love with that. Of course, I just fucking can't get enough. And I'm, you know, I blew um, like an hour the other day but, just swinging around. But I didn't put my skill points towards as much traversal as I thought I would. Mm -hmm. Because There's I was not look much traversal. There's like one or two. There's things. one really good move, and it's the point launch. Yeah, yeah, the point launch is what I was thinking of. And I got, I ended up getting that really late because the other stuff seemed more appealing to me, mm -hmm. including like, like, uh, Dodge zip and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, and there's you know? like a perfect counter too. Exactly. So um, perfect counter is fucking godlike. So basically, uh, that's a really solid version of, I guess, the Arkhaming stuff. Right, yes. is what I'm told. Yeah. So the the. Yeah. No. I don't find it's very close to Arkham at all. The way the way I fight. Okay. Because I'm using a lot of like, because when Spider Man counters dot he never hits he yeah. jumps out of the way that's right Whereas okay Batman's i wasn't even counter well, is always an offensive counter so oh my, i wasn't I, even I, thinking of the fighting when i said that but uh, oh sorry he, you mean the general structure yeah I, I mean the optional missions into like okay i've had enough optionals for now let's go into the main one oh i've unlocked a that, new type that of optional is very similar to city and night like uh, asylum is much more locked down i realized like just going across the city basically that I'm always in the mood for something. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what I'm in the mood for, right? When I see a crime, I'll go stop it. But otherwise, I'm like, I don't know if I want to chase a bird or fix Oscorp's problems or, the, the best. you know, do a a, 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 a construction site, yeah. you know, the, invasion. The, yeah, the, the fucking base construction sites. Like, do I want to fight five waves and have my fingers hurt? Sometimes I do. Sometimes. Yeah. I, I'll do them because I want that suit. But. So, like, I'll, I'll be swinging around. And I've done it the total opposite of what you're describing is every single time a, a you event it unlocks, out. I yeah. clear it out. yeah. yeah. And I think that they've met, nailed it perfectly for both types of players because both types, like if you're swinging around like, oh yeah, naturally you're going to end up completing like half the map's worth of stuff just mm -hmm. in the course of it. And for me, when I unlock Birdman and it's like, hey, find my pigeons, god damn it. It's like, oh, there's 12. There's just 12. Yeah, mm -hmm. so you can do it pretty fast. Black Cat, hey, I'm evil or whatever. I steal things. How many? There's 12. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, That's mm -hmm. so easy to actually do it and is, manage. It is. And like, I remember I was just, I just wanted to get the combat system down. So I was like, I'm just going to go do another construction base yeah. to just get work at this. And then before I knew it, he's like, okay, how many's left? And they're like, that's all of them, Pete. Like, you did it. Yeah. You know, I was like, oh, you'll, shit. You'll unlock uh, challenges later. Mm -hmm. I think there's five combat challenges. So, total. yeah, it's not really too taxing on that in that regard. But it's, again, I just... Uh, but as you go for, further through the story, you'll get more bases yes. having to do with Yeah, yeah. Group. No, no, so exactly. So I, I am at that point. Okay, so, okay. like, well, I've gotten to that. Uh, and I've, I've progressed further, far enough into the story that I'm like, you know... I'm enjoying what's going on. I like the characters. Every so far, everyone is like, "Yeah, you're you're fine." Uh, the like, I mean, the from the from the get go, like your pre like second one, you're working under Otto Octavius. Yeah. So you're just kind of like, "All right, how are we gonna play this out?" Mm -hmm. You know. And so far, I'm like, "Yeah, this is a nice slow burn." It, as you'd hope they would handle it. One of my favorite things in the entire thing, how they handle it. They don't push it too, f like they don't throw. Well, they. You know who he is. You so know what's like, going on. You know of course. what's going on, but yeah. they—they—it's such a great gradient of mm -hmm. where it goes. Mm -hmm. And I'll, I'll just—I just want to say really quickly, like I finished the game, and like having finished the last two hours of encounters and fights, like it has become my favorite Spider-Man media I've ever consumed. Mm -hmm. And it's mostly due to the story and, and how Octavius and, and how everyone's relationships wind mm -hmm, up. Mm -hmm. There's a certain point where it just goes bam and then it, you just go, whoa, this is really just interesting the way where, where this is going. And I don't think you're quite there yet, but it was kind of like... cinematic? <laughs> I mean, I use the term Sony yeah. first party game. You're, uh, you're not the, the only money. person that I've heard say that pretty much exactly. 
Yeah. Like, like it seems to be a very consistent thing of like when this game gets to its final act, it just fucking ramps up. Young Child Pete, uh, uh, Tom Holland, is a fun dynamic in the MCU uh, because yeah. it's very different from the adults running around doing business. Yeah. Right? That's your unique thing is a child is on the battlefield, right? I'm uh, a baby. Pew, pew, webs. Uh, the fun th- of this Spider-Man is the fact that there's been almost a decade of it happening without us. How so many years? Eight. eight. Eight, I know. So, yeah. <laughs> Everyone knows. The, yeah, so the fact that they just go through it like, you know, we know, we all know. And things have moved on in ways that you you don't expect since then. Even compared is always to the a fun movies, thing to revisit. There was never a Spider-Man that was super experienced, knew what was up, was super confident. Mm-hmm. I mean, he's not a hundred percent confident when he's Peter Parker. He still stumbles all of his words. But the the, the Spider-Man that's on display here is like I got this. Is mm. even uh, Amazing Spider-Man movies where he's supposed to be a little bit older, but he was still in school, even though Andrew Garfield's like forty-five. So really- like. What I was no no I was just gonna are you, that, that, that was my yeah no I was just gonna say like there's even stuff where I like I I didn't re I guess it's, it's dumb because it's obvious but I didn't really realize that like uh, you're looking at your newspaper clippings of like oh yeah these are all the bad guys you dealt with yeah and it's like it's like oh there's fucking Fisk and there's Rhino and, and yeah. Gargan and all of them. And then he looks over at Electro, this who's is, like I another was, one down, I down wanted there. To bring this one up, and he's like, yeah. Electro is the first time I had to fight somebody that wasn't that just was some guy in a suit. Guy. Yeah, it yeah. was an actual dude that was super powered. That changed things a lot. And I was yeah. like, that's true. Like, that's I like had to six rethink. or seven years prior. Too. I had to rethink my suit. I had to like... And you just don't think about that in the context, context of the Sinister Six and all that. You're like, no, yeah, that's a very different classification of villain because... You're not just dealing with, you know, dudes in a suit. And then obviously Sandman and, and some of the other characters that like take after that are like classics as well. Still but a, a lot, lot of, of the rogues gallery is just humans. Still a lot you know? of the villains that are in here, like they're 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 these guys and they stay those guys and they have a lot of villains that they didn't even touch. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I feel like Spider Man has three types of villains. He has dudes like the Kingpin, Hammerhead, whatnot. Tombstone. Uh, but they, they they but they roll out the ones that are like you you with less popular, I guess, in this list. So yes. it's interesting. And then he has, uh, then he has elementalists such as fucking Electro, uh, yeah. Electro Sandman, Hydro Man, yeah. people that are physical property man. Yeah, Tombstone even maybe if he's Concrete Man yeah. or whatever. I even, Mega, I Mega, even Mega put, Man villains. Yes, Mega Man. I villains. even put Rhino in there just because he's like this muscle man. based muscle guy. Guts that man. And then and then you have your Guts third man. tier, which is all the the big villains, which is Animal Man. Which well, all include Craven and, 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 and uh, if Vampire is, Man. If they're a super genius too, because there's so many characters that are actually re- like Otto Octavius is smart, uh, Norman Osborn is smart, like, uh, Lizard. Well, oh, he I guess, is and he isn't. I guess I, I guess I, Doc I, Connors is, but yeah. he's not evil. I guess yeah, but but they're fourth, science enemies. Yeah, they're science, science enemies. enemies. I guess there'd yeah. be a fourth tier, science and the fourth enemies. tier would be Goo Person. Which would be the side of the symbiotes. I don't know. I'd say Hydro Man is a goo person. Too. Well, no, you know what I mean, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, like, well, then the, I, that that other category is like alt spideys, right? Yeah. In a way, um, but uh, they, yeah. So they, they they just they go about things in a really fun way and play on relationships in 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 a, in a fun way as well. Um, that's refreshing. Yeah. Uh, single downside so far. Um, is boy, hey, switching off controls for those stealth sections is not fantastic. No, <laughs> you sometimes not amazing nor spectacular. Some of either. those missions. Uh, oh, oh, you mean in general? Some of those missions go like, hey, uh, let's catch you up on like what happened to someone else, and you basically do stealth sections as not Spider-Man. Where you lose all of your regular controls. And, and, you're, and you're doing very basic hide around the corner from the flashlight reticle. And, um, the first cone, one I should, I mean. takes forever. The first one's really long. Yeah, because you have to wait for other things to the happen. The second one's way better. And uh, Yeah, but but like three in. The second one is, is, is way better and, and for you know reasons, but Either way, they're all not great compared to normal gameplay, yeah. and um, which is weird because just to jump ahead slightly, they, they each one each of the characters has a final stealth mission, and both of them for both of them are great. Okay. Like it's almost like the culmination of 
these are fine eh, and offensive, I guess, but they don't really add anything to proceedings. But the last two, and they're both very different from each other, doing, doing very different things. And I'm like, man, I would have preferred just one of these mm. for each of them yeah. or, or something. Because yeah. all the other ones are like ho-hum. And sometimes I'm just, I will actually just be like, Ugh, I can fucking break this and get ahead. And it's like, because I want them over with. Yeah. yeah and exactly. then I'll die because I'm like, oh, yeah. Because you can't. No, I've had, I, I, very I'm more or less, exactly. There's definitely a couple of moments where I'm like, I'm doing it perfectly. And I'm just like, okay, fuck this. And I cut a corner. Yeah, you cut a and corner. then like, I, like the yellow goes up and I'm like, that's ah, fine. And then and it turned out to be fine. And I love though, when they're like, they can't make the game too violent game overs. So it can't be like Leon getting his head exploded or getting asked. Oh, I haven't, what happens when you get caught? You, like, the, the one time I got caught when I was, uh, I think, uh, Mary Jane, I was just like, fuck this. And I, yeah, I did, I, just, I cut a corner. She's, no! And then it just goes, you failed. Mm. And like, it's unclear what's happening. It's just, mm. no! It's hilarious. Can't show Mary Jane riddled with gunfire. That's not good for the kids. Mm. Um, yeah, so those are, those are a low point. And... Yeah, and like the other stuff that it's like just variety gameplay, like oh, you want to solve these fucking slidey pu- not ro- these rotate pipe puzzles. Like if you're down with pipe puzzles, that's cool. If you're not down with pipe puzzles, well, just don't fucking do if them. You, if you're not down with them, there's more than enough research points in the game to get everything. And if you're not down with the one, like here's the thing: there's the ones that you that you do that are optional. Yeah. After like. I don't know what it is, like a minute or two, it'll just say, do you want to skip this? We know this was a bad idea. Oh, yeah? And the skip button just appears. Have you After been, staring at it for a while? Have you, yeah. uh, wow, have you taken I didn't a look know. at the accessibility options in this game? I see there's a lot of them, but they I haven't They are astonishing. Them. Hmm. They include such things as big fucking subtitles like, yeah. uh, that I have. Yeah, I did see they that. They are yeah. fucking big, and I've been using them because they're great. They also have remove every puzzle from the game. I didn't see that. Okay, uh, interesting. They because... also have... Um, uh, to remove all QTEs from the game, or turn all tap QTEs into holds. Okay. Huh. I, I, uh, I mean, look at that stuff. So the yeah, the the pipe puzzles are are fine to me because I've always enjoyed them. Like I did my like I said Bioshock too. You know, I was able to fucking. I think I'm gonna say this that. last time though, but there's story ones that actually I feel kill like the momentum of the game. Where you're in, like I know which ones you like mean. A bat- not a battle, but like you really- have to sol- you have to disarm the bomb. It's you know, it's because that's that's there too. And some bombs you don't even have to disarm. Like uh, the challenge mode, the challenge them. missions, you just throw them and yeah. shoot webs at them. But like there's like the <laughs> into one... into crowded New York. No, he no throws way. them in the, the air, air and then webs them up. <laughs> like they thought about it. Okay, no, the, the the one of the missions I I saw was like there's a bomb in that van. <laughs> And then you yeah. just crack the van open, and he grabs the bomb and he and hurls it down the street like a ha- like a fucking uh, Olympic hammer. Yeah, and it's like there was people there. No, they moved. They moved. Don't worry about it. <laughs> no, they moved them up. Uh, but yeah, I want to say there's three instances where the pipe things came up where I'm like, this actually hurts the tension of the scene okay. because you had now have infinite time. To do this yeah. puzzle, and those are the but, ones that up like those are the ones that actually only that really bother me. But because I enjoy those types of puzzles, I didn't mind. What I don't enjoy are the um, there's these uh, the bar matching, the bar matching on like the the sort of the rainbow slides. I hated those at first, those, but then I started to like them. I yeah, those are not much to me. Like I find them, they're just kind of and like the like. They're, 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 you're basically matching up the lines on a on a pattern, and then you have to learn how to like subtract and add, almost like slides. Peter Parker's a big other. nerd. He's got to do big nerd stuff. At they're some not way. particularly challenging. Um, they just are slow to move the cursor and drag yeah. them around. So I'm like, if I could just go, bah, 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 it'd be fine. But you have to slowly move. It's weird that it uses a cursor into place. at all. It should just be highlighting these yeah. boxes, you know. So those are another downside as we talk about them. Yeah. Um, but you know, again, beyond that, I've just it's I've been having a blast with it, and really controlling it at your own pace, and the fact that like you can do certain types of missions when you want until you're tired of them or until you just don't feel like it anymore. Mm. Um, the unlock trees are all like you got to work to get a full tree. But they're not out of reach. There's absolutely no way anyone could ever finish this game and not have maxed out every tree. Uh, by the well, end. you're past where I'm at, and I'm almost maxed out. There you go. Um, and one huge, huge smart decis- blah, decision they made was being fast, loose, and liberal with the suits is 
awesome. Yeah, you get a ton. This kind of game could have decided to make it like really, really premium DLC only. Get oh, this you mean one like suit. Batman? Yeah, because yeah, using suits is a huge thing that feels good, right? That's a big reward for a game like this is different types of suits because aesthetically it's what you're staring at and enjoying, yeah. right? And then it comes with a certain specific power. What uh, What is the suits that you guys have been using most you of the You can guess what I'm using the well, whole time. Uh, I, I'm, I I'm using the standard game one, the one with the white spider. White, white spider. I actually like that one a lot more than I thought. The, Amer- I, the, America, I, I the America wanna... Man? I want to put that in when I think like a really important story mission is coming up, so I don't look ridiculous. Uh, Spider Man twenty ninety nine, the white suit. Ooh, oh, I didn't. Know that's that. a, I haven't. I haven't gotten that yet either. It's my favorite. Yeah. Um, then there's other suits that I can say what their name is, but you might not know. There's like the last, uh, the, the last stand suit, um, the homecoming suit. Uh, this this suit you get from doing Black Cat's missions. That's the one I've been using. Is the, is that the, one's I cool. It. Is the homecoming is the homecoming suit the like the yellow jacket? No, it's from Homecoming. Oh, just the straight up Homecoming. Yeah. Well, it has three Homecoming suits. default. It, yeah, it has three okay. suits from Homecoming: the Iron okay. Spider, uh, the yeah. the standard Homecoming suit, and his his made up one. Okay. His trash shit, suit. Oh, trash cool, one. fun, fun, fun. Yeah. Uh, I played the trash one for a bit. Uh, the the spider armor, the one that looks like he makes he's a common rider. Mm-hmm. Uh, which one? There's Re- three. There's four big, spider armors. Big red armor okay, with the red the anti sinister kind of looks- six one. Yeah, I think that's looks it. like Deadpool, Iron Man, Spider Man. He looks Spider-Man. like Deadpool and Iron Man. There's a cool big time one. That's uh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's all right. I've been, I, um, I, but I went straight from the Mark II one, which is the yellow and black, mm-hmm. to the Black Cat one. And so look back. I mean, I've I, I I switch occasionally to when I see something I like. Like I'll be, oh, I'll do Punk for a little bit, or I'll do. Um, uh, uh, the wrestler outfit for a little bit or, the, or whatever. I didn't like the wrestler one in the game. I really didn't like it either. But um, generally, 95% of the time, if I'm not just testing something out, my favorite Spider-Man of all time is fucking Ben Riley. Oh, yeah. Scarlet. I, I, I did wear his Always for, forever. For, uh, uh, it's yeah. all red, and he's got a fucking ripped hoodie over it, and, that, and he uses a Sharpie to draw the fucking spider on it. I love it. So much aesthetically, it's exactly the type of Spider-Man suit I love. They're still missing a Clean, lot. No webs. They're you know? still missing a lot of like standard suits that have been in games before, like the silver spider armor that's oh, all yeah. shining. They don't have the Scarlet Spider. Uh, the I mean, new well, Scarlet Spider. There's each, a bunch of rows that are still black for me. So no, like, that means so, these yeah. are ones that are e- not in the DLCs. Okay. Is apparently coming Go, with suits. Yeah, each DLC comes with more suits. Okay. I'm super excited. But they're fast and loose with them, right? Any game that decides to put these. At a premium, they do it because they know that again, it feels really good to use a different suit there, and, and, and there just take are photos two suits and have fun with it. That's locking like credentials, I think, are a bit ridiculous. One of them is the like, bottom two, like lock, lock ones. I'm not sure if it's the bottom two, but um, just, one's complete every side, one's complete in the game. everything in the game. That one, that's one of the ones I mean, but I kind of understand in terms of this is the ultimate reward if it you also beat looks everything. Like shit, so it's fine. It looks like shit. But the, the other one I talked about, which I think you'd really like when you see it, but um, that one is like get 20 tokens of one thing. And okay. I was, it, was one, it was the one thing that personally I was like, I, which, I didn't do uh, that many. Token? I think it was 20 base tokens. Okay, okay, okay. I think. Which, which um, I'm, <laughs> I enjoy it's, the bases, so I'm going to begin that. It's the one with yeah. a red leather jacket and black jeans. Oh, I haven't gotten that it's one It's super. That's, that let me know. fucking great. <laughs> 20, 20 base tokens is... A good time, in it's, my opinion. It's like it's like an entire set of bases. But here's the thing, right? Bases. Everyone can custom build your your combat, right? So I saw you talking on Twitter about like you're like fuck the gadgets. I do, just I, go I, in. I almost never use right? them ever. So I I didn't until I realized oh I can level up all gadgets. I, yeah, had, yeah. I had them all maxed out. So I, I like so using certain ones, not I, all. Of them. I built so I, I I switched up my build. I respect a couple times yeah. basically, right? And they're all valid and in terms of just like speed at, at which you take people out like I had a spec that, and the thing that I prefer is basically just like damage right mm-hmm. so damage and focus so that you're you're taking on um, bonus Are you focus talking about your mods? You, I'm saying put on the focus mod yeah right uh, put on the that mod's amazing 
uh, and put on and basically like use your put your skills up so that you get the double takedowns, mm -hmm. and then yeah. you just do a series of takedowns. Yeah, no, that's right. That's, that's what I've been doing for ever since I locked them. It's like air combo one guy. You have enough meter if you did the perfect presses for like four takedowns, for like yeah. a couple takedowns, and that's really cool. That's a valid, speedy way to get through it, right? Yeah. But then I was like, all right, that works. What else can I try? And I went with, let's try, there's these web zip based ones where it's like, you can zip people up without even having to fucking, you know, whatever. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna try that. And then you buff the zipping so that you can like, keep it going. Yeah. You make it so that um, you get the, the power up, which is you jump in a circle and just web everybody. Oh, that's web blossom. Yeah, yeah web blossom. And like suddenly every fight just gets trivialized because you just pop that and then throw, 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 and it's done. For you web know? blossom specifically, if you keep using it further and further you go in the game, I find less and less people get webbed up. Like they... The be, the, yeah, experts. Yeah, 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 yeah. It the, depends on what type of mission the, you're doing. Web, the, the one gadget that I have found to be extraordinarily useful 100% of the time is impact webbing. Mm -hmm. because yeah. Because if no, that's anyone is near a wall at all, it's they're just, they're just they're on it. Yeah. Um, it just web, the web ball, like the little, like the dealie that if you just throw, ball. it explodes like after a little while. That's just as good as impact webbing. Bomb, the bomb, It's yeah. just slightly slower. Yeah. Um, and the trip mines uh, take out two people usually. Yeah. Yeah. Well, do, you Although, wanna, do you wanna see that suit? Do you wanna this suit to be the one I was describing? Just show me. On? Oh, that's fucking good. <laughs> oh, uh, he oh, just showed us. What's oh, okay. it called? It's, it's a jacket. It's called the Last Stand suit. Okay, that's fucking good. Um, anyway, the um, damn, <laughs> uh, the the gadgets, and I decided to like see. Let's let's how do see how these gadgets work? To you know, I'm like, what, what what's Pat complaining about? <laughs> so in in the process of complaining, I did learn some things. Yeah, and I found something out as well. And what I learned is anyone who hits a wall under any circumstances while in a web state becomes nullified. Removed from the battle. Which changes things slightly. Um, <laughs> similarly to on a rooftop, kicking someone off of it. They're gone. They're ends dead. that. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Spider-Man last stand suit. Uh, suit power. Spider-Man gets super pissed and enemies can't block or interrupt any of your attacks while this is active. <laughs> That's Excuse fucking me. great. I get angry. <laughs> the, uh, the heavies are like... It took, are scary. it took me. It took me like a couple rounds to really learn that you're not supposed to t t time. You have to t time them a, a little bit more precisely than the other enemies. It took me about three quarters of the game to stop getting hit by every single heavy punch. But the heavies because, because you get hit by one, their follow ups are so fast, and you're not. And they that, wind up, but their animation is misleading because yeah. it looks like that wind up is going to result in a full swing, but they kind of lunge forward, and it takes an extra second on it. But in any case, um, the uh, gadget setup was I'm like, okay, call in a spider buddy mm -hmm. and then use three support spider drones. Options. And now you have four things just okay. cleaning well, up the I battlefield. Should, I should mention that the 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 spider bro and the the web loss of moves are the best moves. They, yeah, spider, <laughs> like, they, they are not even strong. close. Uh, the the third best one is probably the first one you get, which is the focus ability, where it just gives you free yeah, focus. Yeah. Well, there, the one I want to one suit with, I don't forget which one. There's one that suits power is just it quads your damage. That's what I was about to bring up. Yeah. It's the the red one with the big arms on it. Yeah, um, I hate that suit. It's it very looks, ugly. It looks hideous. It's yeah. very but, ugly, but I want that power damage. up. Quad damage is one punch kills. Bam, most bam, bam, bam. Yeah. So all that, all that to say that every style works. Yeah. If you decide to fucking unlock uh, Tony Hawk tricks and then super jump and then do a uh, death from above, like that's a valid way to take did out enemies you, too. Uh, did you unlock the challenges yet? No, I'm I'm really low on, uh, or rather, I haven't seen challenge tokens. Uh, uh, it just says right now, play through the mission. The main okay, mission. yeah, no, you'll yeah, get there. Yeah. Okay, so you're not farther than me. Um, is and uh, in the story, there's yeah. there's uh, there's four types. I want to say four. Or I've five. done I've done three stealth stealth sections. Okay, so there's combat, there's stealth, there's uh, bombs. interception and bombs, and the 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 the, the fuck was it called the camera one? You know the one where you follow the camera? Yeah. Those one, it's web swing through points essentially. Those are out, rings. those are outrageous. Oh, they are I, I super tough. I was really glad that fly through the rings was at least the the only way they did that was fly through the smog. 
And Web Through the Smog, and it's kind of contextual in a way. There's a, no, Floating there's, bullshit rings there's a, is there's not There's a checkpoint great. where you're chasing a drone, and the drone will fly all over, and then when it reaches a certain point in its route, it'll drop a ring that you have to swing through. Uh, yeah. And there is no solution to those other than learning the route perfectly. That sucks. Or else you'll never complete it fast enough. Not to, like, dude, not to mention some of those chase missions. Like, there's a helicopter chase that's like... It's very clear during the chase missions, it's like... At the 30 second mark is when you can catch up to it. There is nothing you can do oh, until birds. that point in time. It's the same thing for birds where it's actually... there's. A You're on top of the I bird's was, ass. Because like, as soon as I got there, I just happened to swing in that direction. Five meters where, away like, from the bird. I'm in the nope. bird. It's like, nope. Nope. You gotta wait. And that helicopter one was like, come the fuck on, guys. How is a helicopter cornering around buildings better than I am? You know, and also, why wouldn't you There's just fly above the city? Why would you stay low amongst the buildings? Give, you gotta give Spidey well, a chance. It's, it's way, yeah, heavy I, guess, I guess it's weighted See, down. See, yeah, yeah. Spider-Man. Uh, but boy, yeah, uh, 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 you know, the little, little bit of that, I'm like, yeah, come on. God, that scene is so much money. Yeah, a lot of money in, in, in <laughs> a lot of money. the fucking let's, anytime you see let's destroy the overworld, you know, even partially, you're like, yeah. oh shit, okay. Um... Fun to see the uh, the overworld change as the game goes yes, on. Yes, I didn't expect that. Fun so to see those there's things. There's an old Spider-Man game where it does this, but in the worst, shittiest, dumbest, awfulest way ever. It's Web of Shadows, and New York is fine. And then maybe, I don't know, three hours into the game, it's like symbiotes have taken over the Earth. Oh, God. And now everything, everything just, bam, is just, just destroyed. And there's no NPCs any longer. Okay. Everyone is symbiote. Okay. And yeah. it's so I mean, it's done. based on the runs, Planet of the Symbiotes, but, This you is know. not based... I don't even know if it's based on... I, don't, I think it might have even taken place beforehand. I don't know. But it's so poorly handled. The... Yeah. I, I was supposed to say, I think my only thing that I dislike about the game at all so far is, uh, I don't know if you guys saw, but Tumelo retweeted a pretty good, a funny article uh, a few days ago, which was, they made that video game again, but now Spider-Man's in it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Specifically, it's a very, it's, so a very it's a very Sony you gotta be thing so now. Because yeah. Microsoft doesn't put out games. And Nintendo puts out Nintendo games, but it's like that game is out, and it's Spider. That's very true. The difference just... here is that it feels best to be Spider Man. Yeah, totally. No if, one... I, if I could take any of those games and pick one, it would be I want the Spider Man. Flying version. doesn't feel as good as web swinging. Nope. And that is a huge because there's no testament problem with flying. There's no there's like, no challenge. Skill. You just fly. Yeah. There's no moments of boundless gravity that you get to fucking slow mo. It's, Taking photos as Spider Man, gliding, has, it, while you use focus and slow down and get the perfect shot, yeah. has never felt more like, oh yeah, this is how he does it. Gliding you know? in the Arkham games feels better than flying because yes. at least there's like a resistance there. At, at least you're get falling. There. Yeah, yeah, falling with style. But sometimes when I'm just like, I don't want to swing right now. I just want to point to point and boost off of the points. Yeah, because you can. Totally. And you can do that as like. Like, Until you get to Central Park, you're like, fuck. Yeah, like, if you want to be Ohio Spider-Man, you can do that. You can you can be the lamppost jumper, and the game lets you get around like the, that. The fact that Central Park... It, ugh, Central Park and Spider-Man is, is always so great, because it's this giant fucking area in the middle fuck of the map you. that's like a mobility death zone. That, like, I'll, I'll fucking swing around Central Park yeah. to not go through it. I haven't, like, I have sometimes, but, uh, like, oftentimes when there's, like, missions in Central Park, like that bird watching one. Yeah. And I'm just like, ugh, I can, I can do it. It's just, it's just, it's not much hard. harder. Yeah. It's just every moment feels like that first reveal of, like, the big, the big end of the fucking first Spider Man movie right. where he lands on the flag. Speaking of landing on the flag, I don't know if you landed on the flag. But I, have you noticed that if you land and just pose up on the flag, the fucking birds never go away. They're always doing circles around the flag yeah, because so it's so like, it's photo so you can photo up. And the birds are like, all right, is he taking it? No, all right, curve back. And they just do circles so you get the perfect moment type mm -hmm. of thing. It's, 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 it's funny. What, this is a weird thing to say, but it's like, I one tiny thing, I'm like, eh, whatever, it's not really a, a negative, but it's like, they went out of their way to be like, there's no Venom content, there's no Venom anything mm -hmm. that's not in this game, we're mm -hmm. not doing that. And I'm like, okay, fine, I respect that. That yeah. makes Fuck sense. you. 
because that means I'll never get the Agent Venom Flash Thompson secret agent costume because they're not going to just throw a red I heard Venom you. costume. Yeah, in. yeah, yeah. There's no black costumes. No, I hear you. And I'm you. like, eh, I just want that so I bad. I mean, there but are, but not. They're not, they're not symbiote they're based. Not, yeah. There's yeah. no symbiote based costume. Yeah. Like, even, even mm-hmm. if it was just a black and white cloth costume. Like, you could understand the can of so worms much. that comes alongside there, of that. Of course, right? That's a, a whole game in there itself. Is such a well, massive. Yeah like feeling around the symbiote or lack thereof in this game that it's like boy it'd be cool if they made another one of these That's... like Norman Osborn and Otto Octavius just walking around as Norman Osborn and Otto Octavius for the vast majority of the game at, at least where I'm at they haven't become anybody oh. yet mm-hmm. it's like oh huh hmm I guess mm, either later here or much later in two, and you know. and this Spider-Man has dealt with the symbiote before because he has his little lines about it. Yeah. So you know, it's it's like the, the that's lethal protector. I, that's such a big thing. I don't thing. know if those were actual like in-game storylines or winks at the audience. Little wink, winks. Like I, I think like, they're if, both. I mean, I think it's unclear if he had fought symbiotes. Like, he would have mentioned. So them so out. if in one of those items you're pulling from the past. Where he talks about, oh, this is my first whatever. He probably would have pulled out like a leather jacket and been like, oh, this is when I dressed like a douchebag when I had that, that symbiote that, that on. That black you know? suit. Yeah. But, and he yeah. doesn't say that. But anyway. But, um, but finish the game. The game the game has like two setups for sequels where it's like one is on the villain side and one is on the hero side. Cool, and they're cool. both fantastic. Cool, cool. Yay. Um, yeah, man. It, it, it like, it, yeah, just the... If you haven't, I mean, like, I think if fucking everybody's playing this, but if you haven't... Yes, everyone is playing this. If you haven't, like, the funnest thing about it uh, and, like, what you'll probably enjoy right away is, like, the fact that you beat two missions and then it just goes new suit available, new, just, like, free. And every you beat one more mission, new suit available. Every half hour, you just get a new suit you can wear and there's a giant character select screen and it's fucking... As somebody who's it's, not it's great. into comics, that experience has been like, oh, what the... Why this suit? What? Yeah. What is that? Enjoy it if you want it. Did you get the weird flaming one? No. Uh, the, the skull one? Yeah. I didn't get it, but it was the last suit that I got, like, the ability to unlock. And I'm like, just looking at it. If you want like, a hilarious playthrough, play through the story and look at the cutscenes where he speaks in that suit. Oh, what? He has a modulated voice? I know. Like, just oh, animation-wise. Just, hey, I'm a skull monster. <laughs> hey. It's so um, stupid. I think uh, I think Miles is is, is all right so far. Uh, it's only been it's only been like really limited exposure. I only have one problem with Miles and his storyline. The first part of his storyline is, is insane. Uh, is, is no, it's no, no, it's it's aggressively foreshadowed to an absurd degree. Yeah, there's that, but it's, also it's the f- like. But well, it, you're going to the thing. Yeah. You're like, boy, I wonder what's gonna happen. No, but you know how like your regular your regular person that becomes a hero has to have the bravery that shows that they're willing to throw themselves into danger. Gotta fight that sludge danger. monster, even though I got no powers. Uh, yeah, fucking macadamia. Yeah. Um, the level of like Miles, what are you doing? He should have died in, is that, in that scene. Beyond insane. He should have died right? for sure. There's a couple of moments of like this family is so wholesome and pure that they're they're throwing yeah, themselves it's not into like danger. He's a hothead that would no, do that. They're this family is so wholesome and pure that they're throwing themselves into danger, which is established, and then they go beyond the point that that makes any sense to do anymore and they're still like no nah, I'm doing it though I think it's because his dad hammers home that lesson what was it it's like you can like all you need to be to be a hero is not be a coward I, I guess <laughs> like, but, I think but there's a difference between cowardice and, and running, walking into an running into gunfire gunfire I don't know. you know what I mean like I think that's just what they were going for is all I'm not saying it makes sense like yeah, it's, it's that scene is wild. Like it, it's just it's it, there's a difference between those two things, you know. Like sometimes you can help, other times you cannot. And in times when you cannot, but you decide you're still going to try, it feels a bit like you're kind of just running to your death. <laughs> you know, I can't parse this, that. It's not an intelligent this is decision also anymore. A slight negative. This won't mean anything to Wooly, but it would to Pat. It's Let's like, hear it. Towards the end, uh, like you know the scarecrow moment of the Arkham games. Sure do. Spider-Man says, I want to have six or seven of those. And I'm like, that's a lot of them. Scarecrows work because they were really far apart. Yeah. Like, really far apart. They were like four or five hours apart. I'm I'm saying seven's way too many. I want to say there's four. But in what span are we talking? Three hours. That's too much? 
They're cool. Sure. They're totally cool. But that right. makes you for like get yeah. ready for the the next one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Game's rad. Game's super rad. Game's very rad. It's very good. Um and like while like and uh the North American numbers are not in, it's like apparently like like you know It's you, demolishing God of War. It's in the UK I think someone said it's like it sold more in its first week than God of War did in its first month yeah. in the UK. There was that article just, that and also also Spider Man. Did you see that fucking The world is obsessed with Spider Man. Sure, He's, but the last the couple char- of games did not sell well. No, but it is the character that is like bootlegging on all those weird Elsa Gate videos. Did you see for a reason that I think it was Forbes or Wall Street Journal or something put out some fucking online article that was like Spider Man for the PlayStation proves that the right IP can still s- motivate sales, and it's like it's Spider Man. Yeah, that is always it's, the right it's, IP. It's the IP. That's insane. There is no. I cannot think of a single property ever that would be more likely to sell a product than Spider-Man. We know how much people that are that don't speak English love Spider-Man. Yeah, that yeah, doesn't yeah. apply to a lot of other characters. I, like, I apparently did really well in Japan, too. There you go. Well. Spider-Man invented Kamen Rider and Sentai. <laughs> Directly. <laughs> like. Directly. He couldn't be more worldwide but it is true that yes this game has been released and this time spider-man is is that's the like character. I'll, I'll, it's it's the simplest formula in the world studio with a good name plus spider-man yeah. equals <laughs> a shit zillion dollars i enjoy doing marvel versus capcom spider-man moves a lot I really try to recreate they just straight those. Straight up have them. A whole bunch. Giant they web got swing. Spider Sting. They got it's web really balling. clear that. The, the, yeah, the Spider Swing. Spider Sting, they, Spider Swing. It's really clear that they do No throw maximum some of spider. Them. Web ball. Oh, you can almost do you it. You can though. almost do it, but it's not a With the point launch and the wall yeah. jumps, you can almost do it. Fair enough. Um, boy, EA has fucking wasted that Star Wars license, haven't they? <sighs> Man. Yeah. I remember there were talks about Disney maybe taking it away from them because like they've they've wasted it. Battlefront was the franchise that like got people in though, right? Like that was the most that was the best like Super Star Wars feeling one. And Jedi Outcast and the, the you're you're mistaking the, fe- the that good feeling for Battlefront because it died. Like the pe- Battlefront, like one and two, with the original ones when they came out, were like back to back big successes. And yeah, because it was the game. Them. It was the game that brought all the different like Star Wars the games Call together, of Duty right? Of it. it was the game that just lets you pilot anything yeah, but, and control anything. But also, whereas in, in, in other before that, you had to play like X Wing game or the the you know, resurgence of the, game. of the popular Star Wars game is the one that you played was Kotor. Right? Was the one was like fucking Star Wars That's games. True too. Yeah. That's true too. Yeah. yeah. And, and just like for me, it was Rogue Leader, and then I'd say, and Force Unleashed came out. Yeah, I'd say more importantly, um, the the paranoia of making a studio build something around a movie coming out. You should relax that. You should let them take their time and do something that. The, what are the two examples? Well, they canceled Fucking all those. Spider Man and and Batman were were not even no movies no Ex- explicitly like, anti movies like let a them, year before yeah, this but even let the game build its own strength. Well, you're you completely know? right, and that's what Star Wars thirteen thirteen was gonna be, and then they yeah. killed that because um, Amy Hennig doesn't know how to write a single player storyline that people would buy. Apparently, well, just well, just, uh, well that's sarcasm. As, if yeah, anyone didn't yeah, catch yeah, that, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, as you mentioned KOTOR, it just makes me think of the fact that it's like, yeah, look at all these games that are not tie-ins that had time to become their own developed worlds I mean, and these familiar things we love. And KOTOR and, came out and alongside the fucking prequel trilogy, and it was like a replacement yeah, for that. Star Wars that, feeling. That, I forgot <laughs> about that. It came out alongside <laughs> trash movies that disappointed oh, everyone and su- succeeded in spite of it. Yeah, so you gotta let it go. Anyway, um, yeah, man. Spider-Man's really good. Sp- Spider-Talk. Uh, I finished Disenchanted. It's, it was funny. It was worth watching. I'm going to check out season two. Cool. Still no belly laughs, but definitely a but solid... But the storyline actually yeah. took a hold where I'm like, wow, this is kept, actually a bit more interesting. Kept, kept me going to the point where I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm invested. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to watch this. Disenchanted is... It's, it's funny enough. 
But no, that's not true. I feel like there were. But you see, here's the problem. Excuse me, just a second. I did have one or two really big laughs, but I can't remember what they were. Yeah. Okay. Fair um, enough. Me too. I think. You know, and it, it kind of has that problem. I, there anything. was one that killed me. And it's like <laughs> it was either. It was something somewhere, you know. But I ah. say in episode six or seven. Yeah. Or yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah. Um. But but that's that's the whole thing exactly right like it's still it's still fun enough to watch and it even has its action moments and it's like yeah you know fight scenes if you and would it's not even <laughs> strictly season two it'll be part two which is a weird distinction I guess certain Netflix shows Netflix do this call it now parts. they don't even call them seasons now yeah. but then they have shows where they're called seasons so mm-hmm. I don't I don't know how they're separating it what'd you do man uh, played a bunch of Spider Man and beat it mm-hmm. but uh, we kind of went over that but I did. Um, with a heavy heart, see the Predator. Turns out not a whole lot of people were in the mood to go see the Predator. No, almost the exact same amount that went to go see Predators years ago. They-